Hi guys, and welcome back to another video. So today I've got a ball mastery workout to get you over 1,000 touches on the ball in around 10 minutes. Before we jump into the exercises, I wanna say a huge thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. From analytics to websites and marketing tools, Squarespace is the all-in-one place to grow your online presence and manage your business. Jumping right into the first exercise, we're gonna use a combination of the sole and inside of both feet. So we roll it across our body from one side to the other with the sole, stopping it with the inside of the opposite foot. Then we do the exact same movement one more time, and then we repeat in the opposite direction. For each of these exercises, we're gonna go for 60 seconds without stopping. So while you're resting for 20 seconds, I'll show you the next exercise. So we're gonna use the inside and soles again, but slightly different pattern. So go from the inside of one foot to the inside of the other, and then we roll it with the opposite foot and stop it with the opposite foot one more time. Let's get ready to go for 60 seconds. For the third exercise, we're using the sole inside and outside of both feet. So we roll it across our body with the sole of one foot, we stop it with the inside of the opposite foot, and then we take a third touch with the outside of that same foot and repeat in the opposite direction. For the fourth exercise, we're gonna drag the ball back towards us using the sole of one foot. We're gonna open up our hips and push the ball with the inside of that same foot 90 degrees. Put that same foot on top of the ball, drag it back towards us, this time exchanging feet and back to the center.
For exercise five, we're performing roll chops. So we roll over the ball with the sole of our foot, and then with the inside of the opposite foot, we're hooking it behind our standing leg to stop the ball, and then we repeat the same movement in the opposite direction. Exercise seven, we step around the ball, then with that same foot, we push it from one side of the body to the opposite with the inside of both feet. And then we're gonna perform an L drag with the opposite foot once again, stop the ball with the sole and then repeat in the opposite direction. For this one, you can add an extra touch after the L drag to roll it across the body for a bit more of a challenge. And for exercise seven, we're combining a roll step over with a Cruyff turn. So we roll the ball across our body with the sole, step over the ball with the opposite foot, then with that same foot, we hook the ball behind our standing leg with the inside and repeat in the opposite direction. Before I go, I want to say another huge thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. Squarespace is where I built my very own website, www.7mlctraining.com. It's been an absolute game changer for me. It's allowed me to put my programs online, including Maestro and Maestro 2.0, which are both seven day ball mastery training programs. If you're looking for more exercises similar to these to take your confidence on the board to the next level. It also gives you access to my podcast, links to my Instagram, and it's become the central hub 
of my entire brand. So if you have a brand or an online business, I would recommend Squarespace because they provide websites, analytics, and marketing tools. They really are the all-in-one place to grow your online presence and manage your business. And if you use the link in my description, www.squarespace.com 7MLC, they'll give you 10% off your first website. But if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you smash the like button, hit that subscribe button for weekly training videos, and I will see you guys in my next video.